We have um, a fellow Bulgarian company with an interesting story, but I will not tell it for you. Uh, that would be Georgi, whom I want to invite on stage to join me. There is this great thing in uh, the holy grail, I'd say, uh, in, in any entertainment industry is to own the intellectual property. And it's difficult. Imagine, like, you've heard the Lego guys earlier today. You just saw uh, uh, the team from, uh, from Creative Assembly. And what they do have in common is that they are working on already existing and established intellectual properties. So they fought relentlessly for the hearts and minds of audiences, and they obviously won those fights for some of them. Uh, but bringing a brand new intellectual property, a new universe, if you may, a new character, set of characters, stories, and fighting for that ever more increasingly complex challenge of breaking to the barrier of limitless opportunities that there are. And we have a contender coming up from Bulgaria with a big piece of news. Uh, maybe I can remind you, yeah, that's, that's Georgi, uh, Gigi, another person whom I've met back in the days in those murky places, the internet cafes and computer clubs of Bulgaria. He kicked my ass in StarCraft some months ago, and I will get my chase on revenge in a few months, but it's another story. So a round of applause okay. for Georgi from Zenart, please. Hello. <laughs> Testing, one, two. So, um, hey everyone, thank you for coming. Thank you for your introduction. I was just gonna say that he's gonna do the presentation because we don't have this, but. Um, since we got invited very recently to, to the event, uh, come back here, come back all here. Right, all right, Where are you going? <laughs> He's going to be staying here, so he will be doing most of the presentation. All right. And I will be moderating it. All right. So that's for real. Okay, uh, that's like totally off script. I don't know what to do. I don't know if he's joking or not. <laughs> no, I'm but joking. Great respect who you are. No, no, no. Now that you gave me the opportunity, okay, fine. <laughs> this is it. No, I'm joking. No, it's, it's, it's all yours. <laughs> um. Um, so I will quickly run you guys through to the company that uh, we have and uh, that we represent, which is uh, Zenart, as you can see. <laughs> and um, I'm going to try to not bore you much. It's going to be quick, uh, just so you are on the same page with us as who, who are we. And uh, so we have been in the Bulgarian market and in the national market for like seven years now, maybe, <coughs> maybe a little bit more. And um, we have been working on some of the, um, let's call, uh, stunning visual quality VR projects. Um, we were specializing in photogrammetry, and uh, we basically captured um, <coughs> uh, Machu Picchu. We captured uh, some Greek temples. We also captured uh, some Egyptian uh, temples. But um, as Martin said, uh, we, we are all very, very passionate uh, gamers, and uh, we know each other for what is it, 20 years? Since the birthday of Zeratu, the mighty leader of the Protoss. <laughs> yeah, we are old, we are old. So, in 2021, uh, we, uh, we basically grew to a, from maybe about 30 people that we're working uh, with, with everyone that's outside the office to about 55. <coughs> and we have been steadily growing since then and uh, we, we went into multiple other projects, um, but something something was missing. And as he he, he said uh, already, we <laughs> we are ready for the next big step. Um, but bef before I actually um, go into the next big step, um, it, it's kind of very very quiet around here. I'm going to ask you guys: How many of you are playing games? Can we see some hands? <laughs> so. The people that don't play games, you can leave. Everyone else. That's how welcoming the gaming industry is. <laughs> <laughs> they will give you the money back for the tickets. <laughs> so, we are somewhat rebranding. Not exactly rebranding, but maybe rebranding. And um, we are going into full-fledged uh, game development. 
And uh, what does that mean? Um, live services, microtransactions, uh, pay to win, all of that. Something that we all love. Uh, no, actually, that's, uh, that's a different topic. So the, the new company that we are find, uh, founding is a subsidiary of uh, the older company and uh, it will be developing for consoles and PC and uh, we have expanded our team with some of the industry veterans. Um, some of those names you probably recognize, some of them you don't. We are adding uh, multiple people to our team and um, we're looking to go into the console gaming. Um, I, I'm not going to introduce them one by one. If you guys have any questions, feel free to ask. <coughs> feel free to stop me. Uh, you can also ask questions if you like. Oh, but you bet. <laughs> no, no, you're allowed to ask questions. Mm. Um, but most of you are actually here just uh, so you can see the actual announcement that we are doing. So you're going to have to wait another 20 minutes. Or maybe, maybe we, we can actually play it now and we can, we can let you know afterwards what we're doing. Sound, please, guys. Once, this land was peaceful and undisturbed. We were kin to magic, and its untamed spirit flowed through our veins. You came uninvited. Your shadow spread upon our home. My son would have stood against you if he were here, but he's not. You brought ruin, death, and sorrow to our people. My son would have protected them had you not taken him from us. But you did. You severed the threads of magic that once flowed through our lives. My son would have mended its broken strands if he were still alive. But he is not. You did not understand chaos. <coughs> In your ignorance, you imposed order where it did not belong. But your worst mistake was letting me live. You brought darkness. I will show you darkness. You feared chaos. I am chaos. I will come uninvited. I will destroy what you built and rebuild what you destroyed. This would have scarred your very essence if only you would have seen it. But you will not. I cannot resurrect my son, but I can send you to him so you beg for his forgiveness. He was just a child when you slaughtered him. A kind, innocent child. He would have spared you. I will not. <laughs> okay, so um, going back to what you just saw, as you have probably guessed, uh, we are going into full-fledged game development. And um, 
a few notes on the game and then I will let you guys ask as many questions as you want. I don't promise to answer everything. I will answer some of them. Um, <coughs> it's a third person game, triple uh, A. Uh, so it's inspired by Slavic culture, um, low magic. Don't make any associations to The Witcher. It has nothing to do with The Witcher. It's got a dynamic gameplay, um, but it's also story driven and it's, uh, it's got a captivating narrative. And most importantly, because we are old and we don't like the current scene of the games, we're going back to the roots of gaming. So that means no DLCs, no cash shop, no cosmetics, no pay to win, no always online. You buy the game, you play the game. That's the only model that we, we are going to be doing. A few elements of the gameplay from the game. Uh, you can see like uh, all the art in the game is custom and ev everything is being done by us inside house. Um, as I already said, it's a third person game, but it's got um, some Random effects caused by, by elements, so no two playthroughs will be the same. The narrative will probably not be changing too much, uh, but the actual environments might be changing. You will also have your own uh, progression during the game. I'm happy to also share some of the uh, behind the scenes arts uh, from the game with you. Uh, it's, it's all in the concept arts. So none of that is final. You might see some of them, or also might see something else. So we were quite quick. Thank you very much. And uh, fingers crossed that this mission that you just shared today with us is going there. I think he forgot to mention that your relation, the status of a relationship just changed. That's strictly confidential. <laughs> uh, We're not allowed to no, talk about it. Not here, not on stream, not in the chat. Um, <laughs> please take a seat. The red it chair is, staying, is yours. It is staying strictly confidential, so we <laughs> haven't showed it anyone else <coughs> so far. All right. So we don't have that much time for questions, but I'm sure that Gigi and his team will be around. They're also over there in the exhibitors area, so yep. you can catch him for questions. Um, so. Yeah, I have a few on my own. Uh, so, like, please share your questions, upvote because we would definitely not have the time for all the questions. Um, who, who's, who, who is playing the violin? Who is playing the violin? It's yes. definitely not me. <laughs> is this the level of information that you're going to be sharing? So I, I know how to find <laughs> my questions. No, it, it <coughs> is. It is an important person from the game. That is as much as I'm willing to share. Uh, you guys will be finding out who she is, what is her motivation, and all those things soon. All right. Uh, trademark soon. Okay. I was afraid that you would add that. Um, <laughs> okay. So, um, yeah, seems like the, 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 the good and the bad guys are maybe, I don't know, like who... I, I already wrote for the guys, but I seem with a vicious um, plan. So, is this a catch? Like... Are you trying to, to fish some information, or do you know something that I don't? Um, I'm just speculating here. That's yeah. my job, to speculate. It, again, not everything <laughs> that you guys have seen it is, is the way it is. That's, okay. that's uh, like as much as we can share here. All right, cool. So like, all the question is, what's next, when's going to have more, and so on, are, I think, irrelevant at this point. But let's, let's uh, ask this. Uh, where shall we follow? We just follow uh, so, Total uh, Zen or? Yeah, very soon uh, we're going to have like uh, the websites for the game and uh, for the new company as well. Very soon again, trademark, Blizzard trademark, but perhaps within the next month. But for now, this is as much as we can share. Um, but feel free to like explore any questions that you might have. Okay. Uh, is it open world? A question from the audience. No, uh, that is open? something. Like it, it is not it would open greatly world. Greatly help if you if you undersign your question so we know who's asking. That makes up for a better conversation. So that'd be much appreciated. Um, what platforms? Uh, it's going to be on PlayStation, Xbox, and PC. Releasing when? <laughs> soon. Sorry, I had to try. Releasing Sorry, soon. Forgive me. Releasing soon. That's my this job. This decade. <laughs> Within this decade. 
these decades? That's news already. <laughs> Ambitious, no, 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 hopefully not. Um, all right, um, just like uh, a question from Alex B. How many people do you estimate that you would need to create this AAA game and who will be publishing it? Uh, so our current estimation is over 100. Remains to be seen whether we're going to have to maybe be more than 200 or not. Mm. But it's around 100. And the latter part of the question was... And who will be publishing it? Who will be publishing it? Uh, we're not allowed to say, but we are in talks with multiple publishers. PlayStation is one of them, but nothing is confirmed yet. Okay, so you, you, we can milk some information out of you. Maybe. It seems. Um, okay. Um, I, I don't know, like, I'm, I'm personally fond of the, of the environment that you've, uh, that you've shared, and I'm rooting for the, for the black yeah. lady <laughs> with the violin. Um, guys, we have, like, a few more minutes for questions. I can go for hours, but if you have some, um, would be, um, that would be helpful. Yeah, I, I think it's a very important one. What engine are you using for the project? What engine? So it's all Unreal Engine 5. If anyone here is supporting Unity, we're sorry, guys. We are sticking to, Uni uh, to Unreal Engine 5. <coughs> and that's how it is going to stay. Okay. Uh, we're work working closely with Unreal, and uh, we have like, uh, people that are helping us from the actual engine, so we have a good mm -hmm. connection with them. OK. Um, Another one coming up. How many people, I uh, know that, that uh, I had this one already, sorry. I, I wanted to ask you, so like, uh, if say I'm here and I want to maybe work on this uh, project. You want to report on it? Uh, pardon? What do you want to do on it? If, if I want to join the team, like are you, do you yeah, have any uh, open Yeah, we are or? in open recruitment for multiple positions. Uh, very soon there's going to be more information, but if anyone feels to, you can talk with, with us afterwards. Yeah, including there is a violin player of <laughs> position on the website. We already have that position filled. <laughs> Taken, all right, <laughs> see? Um, so there is Vasil from Game Changers Media. Thank you, Vasil, for the question. Love the art, love the mood and the cinematic setting. Question, can we expect multiplayer? Uh, no, I'm sorry. There's not going <laughs> to be any multiplayer. It's ma a narrative. <laughs> <laughs> or maybe the other way around. I don't know what are the expectations. I, I myself, more and more lately, find joy in single-player experiences for games. Uh, it's, it's, it's a narrative game, so look at it as uh, something similar to God of War. To, uh, to what, sorry? To God of War. All right, cool. Yeah, all right. Uh, so another two minutes for questions, if you have any. Is there anything that you want to add that I did not ask you? Maybe the release date? Uh, thank you for, for actually being here, and thank you for making the, 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 the event. Uh, it's the first time we have had this event like <coughs> in Bulgaria, and we're happily looking for the next year when we can probably share some more on... <laughs> on this one, if you invite us, of course. Yes, now we put a, a, a clock, 365 days <laughs> <laughs> counting. We will schedule your presentation in exactly a year. Um, uh, there is one question, I think it's like, the game is in Bulgaria. Um, like that's a, either a meta question or a typo. Uh, I don't imagine the game being in Bulgarian, right? Uh, is, you mean whether it's going to be in Bulgarian or whether it's following Bulgaria that's, or what is the question? Yes, that's yes. <laughs> no, the question uh, yes, is. Yes, okay. The, the, no. I, I think we see a typo. The game is in Bulgaria. Yeah, the game is made in Bulgaria by a team in Bulgaria. Yeah, it's based. Yeah. The company is based here. The team is not mm -hmm. only Bulgarian. We have like uh, people all around the world. All right, cool. Uh, well, thank you very much for sharing this exciting news with us. And um, yeah. Um, I'm really thrilled to see what's, uh, what's coming next from you. Thank you, Gigi. Thank you for having us.